Hey there, soul campers. I'm so glad to be with you again. Lara Riggio here from my Central Park Energy Center in Manhattan. And this video is going to show you where to put the oils I gave you to help you re-energize your body and to digest toxins in your system, whether they be chemical or toxic emotions that you no longer need. So you're going to need your energy oil, okay? Um, if you have lemon, get that out, and your grounding oil, which is cypress oil, okay? So if you just have energy, it's fine, um, or if you just have lemon, it's fine, or if you have the cypress, you can use that too. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna show you the positions and which oil to use where, okay? So roll up your pants leg. Okay, I've done this side, so take a minute and roll up your pants leg because you need to have these points clear and free so you can stimulate them, okay? And then you're gonna take either your energy oil or your cypress grounding oil, and you're gonna take it out of the bottle, put it on your fingertips, and you're gonna rub it on your K1 point. So you're gonna find your ball of your foot and you're gonna put it right under the ball of your foot, rub it right there, that's your first kidney meridian point in the kidney, Meridian from the Chinese Meridian system that acupuncturists use. You're gonna rub this point as hard as you can. Remember from class, really dig your finger in there. And then you're doing the other side. Remember you're using cypress or energy oil. Either one will be great. Put it underneath the ball of your foot. Really dig into that point. And remember, if these points are tender, they really need this. And the more you work these points, the more free and easily the, the energy in your bodies will move through these pathways, the better you're gonna feel too. Okay, great. Now we're gonna continue up the kidney meridian and you're gonna put the oil now. You're definitely gonna use energy oil for this. So if you were using Cypress, put it down, use the energy oil for this. And you're gonna put this around the back of your medial malleolus here, okay? If you don't have energy and you have lemon, you could use the lemon oil here as well, okay? But if you have the energy, move, use the energy oil. Rub it all around the back of that medial malleolus and really dig into those points, guys. You know if they're tender, it needs it. So move that energy, then you do the other side. Again, behind that bone, these are key kidney meridian source points, really rub behind there. Excellent. Now you're gonna come up in the crease, right here where your knee, oops, creases and your calf connects to your thigh. So right in that crease, rub, either energy or lemon oil there, and really dig into that point, guys. Do the other side, rub that oil in the crease really hard, get those pathways opened up. Very, very, very nice. Now, you're gonna go to the top points here in your kidney is in K27. You're gonna find your clavicle, that bone, at the bottom of your throat. Go next to it, actually under that and next to your sternum. There's two points right here. It almost feels as though from your clavicle there's a little bit of a hole or a divot that's next to your sternum on either side. Put a little dot of that energy or lemon oil there, here and here, and you're gonna really, really rub those points hard. Dig in there. <laughs> oh, remember how energized you felt in class after this, so it's worth just a little bit of discomfort now. Good job. Okay, good. And really, you only do as hard as it feels good, guys. Um, the more you do this, the less sensitive and tender these points will be. Okay, now, if you have lemon oil, you're gonna to switch to using that. If you don't, stick with the energy oil, it'll work for this too. We're gonna to do liver. So, put the oil on your foot, but you're gonna put it this time 
in between your two toes here. So go from the inside of your big toe, trace down in that little space between your big toe and your second toe. Rub that point really, really hard. And this one is probably gonna be pretty tender on you guys. It is on a lot of people. Rub that intensely. Go ahead and do the other foot, same spot. Remember using your lemon oil or your energy oil. Go in between those two toes, really rub this out as hard as you can. Awesome, 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 awesome. Now, you're gonna go rub this oil. Find a tender spot along your calf here, mid calf on the inside. This is a key liver point. And remember, just go up this way, whatever spot feels a little tender, rub that oil in. You're in the right spot if it's a tender point. <laughs> Other side, mid calf, rub that spot, then maybe a little tender, give it a good rub. And then you're gonna go back in that crease, right in that crease, rub in there, wherever it feels tender, dig into it. And let's do the other side, rub into that crease. And then we're gonna hit some spleen points. Use that same oil, and you're now gonna go on either side of your bunion bone here. Okay, so either side of this bone that runs off your big toe. Put a little oil above it, little oil of oil below it. Rub these spots as hard as you can. They're key spleen points. And then you're gonna go up and you're gonna go right in front of this bone. So this is where your medial malleolus is. Go up from your big toe, right in front of that bone. Rub those points. And then on that same leg, you're gonna go, if your patellar tendon attaches right below your knee on this bone, go inside of it and rub this area inside your knee. Again, wherever it feels tender, you probably need it. So find a tender spot and just rub it out. Okay, other side. Oil on your fingers. Remember, you're going right here above this bone and below it. Rub these points as vigorously as you can. Awesome, now come on the inside of this medial malleolus, so go from your toe in front of that bone and rub that point, spleen point, and then go up right here on the inside of your knee. So if your kneecap is here, you're going down and in right here. Rub that out. And then you're gonna put that same oil on the front of your rib cage, right here, and on the side, rub it in, liver and spleen points together. Again, other side, front of your rib cage here, and side of your rib cage. Rub those points as hard as you can, and then we're gonna tap them, okay? So <laughs> you are going to go on the insides of your toes, okay? Right here on the insides of your toes, you're gonna tap those points as hard as you can, right above that big bone, go below that big bone. Tap about 10 times. Now come up in front of that bone where you just rubbed the oil, tap up, hit that sore spot, center calf, come up, tap in front of your knee, and then you're gonna tap up the insides of your legs, insides of your legs to your rib cage, and then to the sides of your rib cage. Woo, you feel that energy? <laughs> now you're gonna go in between the big and second toe, tap here, as hard as you can on liver, 10 times, come up inside of that bone, that sore spot, mid-calf, 
Then come up in your crease in between your knees. Tap up the center of your legs to your rib cage. And feel that energy surge again. Now, kidney, you're gonna tap underneath your feet, okay? So, use both hands, tap both feet at the same time, and then you're gonna come up behind those medial malleolus bones. So, tap from here, behind those bones, wherever it feels sore, up the calf, into that crease, and then up the center, under your clavicle, tap that nice and hard kidney, and then relax Woo, and feel that energy surging through your body. Now, if you want to, go into the next exercise and help connect these moving energies to, the, to your dreams. Let this energy power them and shoot them into your future. So much love and energy.